A possible court fight is brewing as an airbag manufacturer refuses the government's demand to recall 67 million airbags. So what does this all mean for the drivers of the millions of cars that would be affected? CBS2 investigative reporter Tim McNicholas has been looking into that question. Tim, what are you learning? Christine and Maurice, the National Highway Traffic Safety Administration says there is a risk of a part in these airbags exploding and sending shrapnel throughout the car. They say cases are rare, but nonetheless unsettling to hear a week away from one of the busiest travel weekends. Regulators say there's a defect in the inflator for some airbags made by ARC Automotive, and the explosions have killed two people and injured at least seven others. Now, just this month, General Motors has recalled nearly one million Million vehicles made from 2014 to 2017. Cars affected include the Chevy Traverse, GMC Acadia, and Buick Enclave. But not every individual car of that make and model is being recalled. GM says they'll notify customers if yours is affected. I guess our general feeling is, you know, why why take that risk? Uh, you know, if you have, if you're recalling almost a million vehicles. Why not just go recall the whole bunch uh, just to be just to be safe? I mean, customers are going to be asking questions. And General Motors says they will be notifying customers who are under recall by mail. From there, you'll have to go to the dealership where the airbag module will be replaced for free. This investigation has triggered several recalls since 2017 from automakers like Volkswagen, BMW, Ford. Experts say there may be more than 30 million cars with these inflators. ARC is insisting the parts are safe. Christina Maurice. Okay, Tim, thank you.